Hey guys, I'm going to give you a quick overview of the uh, thermostat I've made for my fermentation chamber. Essentially it's a controller to run a freezer which keeps a constant temperature inside the freezer for brewing beer, essentially fermenting stage of it. So essentially you have here is the outlet, you can see it's on right now. Um, this is where you would plug in the freezer to control it and then right here is the actual thermostat or the thermistor the reading device and you can see here on the end is uh, the actual where the temperature is read from and then it inputs into the device and this device actually this part here goes actually into the freezer okay so I'll give you a quick overview of what the menu system and how the actual thermostat works so you can see here there's three buttons the menu button which works as an enter button as well this will get you to in to the me actual menu within there and then uses a, works as a select button or enter and then the up and down arrow keys uh, on the main screen then shows the program line here shows you right now it's just set at manual temperature so you can change it to whatever you want to the set temperature which is actually set to 68 degrees right now and the actual temperature which set which shows 76 degrees which is actually the temperature within where I'm at right now since it's not actually in a freezer and then this here is the days uh, so it shows the time that it's actually been at this manual temperature and right now I have it set up kind of in a demo mode so it's actually running internally faster than it normally would so one day now is actually with you know a couple minutes worth so what I'm gonna do is I'll go ahead and set up one of the programs or I'll start one of the programs so hold the menu button down and then it goes to the menu you can see here you scroll down and you can hear you set and reset a program adjust a current program edit a program that's already been stored Um, some uses statistics shows you how long the device has been running, uh, how long it's had the freezer on over the past week, uh, month, whatnot. Um, here's a setup menu, and within there you can change uh, several of the setup aspects of the thermostat as far as like Fahrenheit versus Celsius and several other options you can choose. All right, so what we're going to do, we'll go up to set and reset a program. We'll scroll down and I want to go to, it shows the manual temperature now. Uh, I'll set on default logger which is a program I've stored in here. Hit the menu button to select it. The asterisk there shows that it's selected. Go back up. Hit the back and then exit out of it and it shows now that the current program is default logger and that the phase or the stage of the program is in the shift mode and it's at zero days obviously so what this first mode is is when you first put the beer or the wort into the fermentation chamber it's going to be about room temperature and so the goal is to slowly cool the wort down to about 52 degrees and do it slowly enough that it doesn't shock the yeast within the beer reward and then uh, so right now it's going at about it's, this would in real time it would be about one degree per hour and I've got it sped up so it's about every 10 seconds you get a degree so it'll cruise on down to the next stage which is ferment and then it'll slowly get there when it gets to 52 degrees or one day it will shift to the fermentation stage however you can also jump to that stage immediately by adjusting the current program select there set stage bump it up one to ferment hit enter back exit and so now it shows that it's the ferment stage and zero days and the temperature is at 52 degrees so with the way this program is set up, it's going to stay this way for 10 days. 
and then it's going to go up to a diacetyl rest which slowly brings the temperature up to about 68 degrees over about a day. So I'll change it to that stage. Adjust current program. Set the stage. Diacetyl rest. And actually we can skip that one. We'll go to the next one which shifts it down. Once it gets 68 it slowly goes down to logging phase which is about 34 degrees uh, for several months but it takes a couple days to get down to that temperature so we'll start there exit out of it so it starts it at 68 and then it drops it down about a degree an hour uh, to over two days to get to 36 degrees so what you can also do if you start this in the middle of um, for instance a program or a stage you can change the number of days it's been there so you adjust the current program set the current time and bump it up to the second day and then back and exit so it shows that it's uh, it's been elapsed one day and now you're on 51 degrees it prorates it to where it would normally be starting at that second day and then it continues on so you can see it's continuing down to 50 degrees. So then the final stage of this program is to logger exit out. So now it's at the logger phase and it will stay at this 36 degrees for the next uh, month or two uh, to finish the actual the beer during the logger phase.